So my name is Anna Bomber. Um, I'm in the Sport, Exercise, and Performance Psychology program here at UWGB. My hometown is Appleton, Wisconsin, or kind of like Freedom, Wisconsin area. Um, if anybody knows where Freedom is, I doubt it. Um, and I completed my undergrad at UWGB. So I chose this program. Um, I guess I was kind of caught in a decision point of, I didn't really want to do like, I guess, traditional counseling route or like a research route. And then this program just kind of like showed up right in time when I graduated with my undergrad. And I had a really good connection with Dr. Shu, like one of the program um, directors. So I figured it was worth a shot and I got in and I love it so far. It's like exactly what I feel like I'm meant to be doing. So it's perfect. I'm on the applied track um, in the program, and instead of doing like research um, opportunities, I'll be doing more of internship things. So um, right now I'm actually doing a teaching assistantship with the music department at UWGB, and I will continue doing that, I believe, next year into my internship, um, just helping music students with psychological skill building. Um, and yeah. Yeah, so you could work with something like um, confidence building, um, in which you would kind of use intervention strategies like um, self-talk or maybe imagery to help build a confidence before a performance. A typical day um, in the SEP program is a lot of reading and writing, honestly, um, but it's also a lot of group work. You're really just taking your undergrad skills and maximizing them and doing a lot of like creative thinking, I guess. Like you're not just following, you know, a, like a blueprint kind of a thing like your undergrad was, but you're really thinking outside the box for a lot of things. Um, as far as the schedule goes, yeah, I'm. it's pretty busy. Um, we have one class that's in person right now, and the other ones are online, um, like a virtual class setup. So there's three classes a week, um, night classes. And yeah, it definitely keeps me like very busy, um, especially with that and my teaching assistantship. Um, it's kind of like a, a full-time job. What motivates me is helping others um, because I've struggled with performance anxiety in my past um, and I really want to like help people figure out tactics to help them conquer that um, and I'm kind of working on myself too to figure out how to better that too. Oh, my favorite thing so far, especially in this program, is just like the sense of community that we've built with all of our classmates. I've never felt like so much belonging in a group before, actually, until this program. So that I think that's my favorite thing. My expectations are that they give me a lot of opportunities to kind of explore what I want to do. And they've been so great with that so far, just giving us like, I participated in a podcast a few weeks ago, which was really cool. Um, I'll be helping with like exercise is medicine program um, with Joanna Morrissey next year too. Um, so all these just like different little areas um, that they're giving us. And I would expect these to continue next year too. Well, so far, um, my goals, and it's definitely not all figured out yet by any means, but I think I want to eventually make my own private practice helping um, music students um, or adults, I guess. Um, music, even dance, I've thought about doing too. And I'm also exploring the exercise psychology part of it too, just because I, I think it's really interesting and I'm just trying to like broaden my scope a little bit. Um, so I guess immediately I would want to become a CMPC, which is Certified Mental performance consultant, kind of get some experience um, working for different companies, and then eventually make my own private practice. Um, so one thing I wish I knew about graduate school before starting um, is just how how different it is from undergrad. Um, just it was really shocking to me that the first couple assignments that I handed in weren't weren't too hot. Um, I didn't get the best grades at first, but um, I mean, very soon after that, I was doing better and better. Um, so it's just kind of important to keep your head up and that it's really it's just like your first week or two and it's going to be a little bit rough, but it'll get better from there. I would just say to students that are interested in, you know, school or even graduate programs, um, just to like 
take every opportunity that you're given. Um, and even if you're not entirely sure if you want to do it or not, just go for it. And then if you end up not liking it, you at least learn something from that opportunity. You learn that you didn't like something and then you can move on from there. But it's just important to take advantage of things that you're given. Mm-hmm.